partially blind elderly woman is recovering after a fire burns through her home. Neighbors helped her get out of her house on H Street on the east side early this morning. Veronica Gallegos talked to one of those neighbors and is live at the home tonight with the latest. Veronica? Ted, uh, it, it appears that the house received extensive damage now. As you can see, um, Peggy's, most of Peggy's belongings was consumed by fire or smoke. Now, a neighbor that I spoke to said burglar bars actually made it harder to reach Peggy, the elderly woman inside. Flames was coming out of the window right there. And all I can do is wonder if anybody was there. So I went and tried to knock on the door and try to, you know, see if anybody was there, but the door opened. Daryl Williams found the front door open, but he couldn't get past the home's burglar bars. The first thing I think about, you know, Granny got burglar bars. Then his instincts kicked in. Daryl grabbed a water hose and started spraying the flames, but he admits the worst case scenario did cross his mind. Imagine how she felt being drowned or burned is one of the two worst ways to die. Police eventually got past the bars and were able to get the woman out safely. Her granddaughter stopped by Sunday to see what was left of the home and thank Daryl for helping save her grandmother Peggy's life. And I really do appreciate you calling and getting my grandmother out of there. You know, uh, you know, I really, I know. really, really appreciate it. Peggy is in the hospital tonight. Neighbors say she is in stable condition. Firefighters say the fire is ruled an accident. Veronica, reporting from the east side, Veronica Gallegos, Fox News at 9.